This is Riverwatch for July 31st, 2020. The Penny's Pipeline Company is urging the Federal Energy Regulatory Commission to issue the agency's environmental assessment for the company's amended project. Penny's has sought to divide the project into two phases. In a letter to FERC, the company has asked for the decision and other approvals so it can begin construction of phase one of the project in Pennsylvania. As the summer heats up, dog owners are being asked to be cautious in allowing their pets to swim in lakes and ponds. Harmful algal blooms can develop in warm, stagnant water. Veterinarians say toxins in the blooms can quickly kill a dog. Unfortunately, for a majority of animals that are exposed to these bacteria in the water, it, it is usually fatal. Monitoring in New Jersey this summer has detected three lakes or ponds within the Delaware River watershed where harmful algal blooms present a moderate risk of adverse health effects and where people and pets should avoid contact recreation. Attorneys for a coalition opposing a planned 140-unit housing development in Marple Township say if the town allows the development to proceed, it would violate Pennsylvania's Environmental Rights Amendment. Attorneys for the Whetstone Coalition provided the testimony at a July 28th Planning Commission meeting. Opponents of the proposal say they want the forested buffer around the Whetstone Creek preserved. The Planning Commission will make a recommendation to the Township Board of Commissioners by the end of August.